today's video we will be checking out an unreleased bundle in cold war zombies and multiplayer i guess if you want to count it and that is the weaver disciple bundle that comes with a klaus finisher yes you heard me right so that's what we'll be doing i'll be showing you how you can get the secret bundle that is currently not out and also i will be giving in to treyarch and activision once again and giving them a whole bunch of money for that case if you want be sure to drop a like on the video as it does really help me out and also be sure to subscribe we're on the road hitting 30,000 subscribers before vanguard and it is becoming more and more possible as we are super close which is insane not to make this video any much longer let's get right into it hope you enjoy so right now we are on warzone the best game ever the best game mode definitely but if you want to get this bundle you have to specifically be on the warzone actual thing you you can just download it if you don't have it buy it and then leave you know like give them your money and then dip uh, now the bundle is $20 basically it is quite a lot of money but you get V bucks back I guess if you want to kind of like I guess think of it that way it's not like you know the 1000 cop ones the way you access this skin is going over to the operators finding Weaver on the Cold War section god he looks ugly on this game <laughs> oh my god then go to customize for me it's pressing triangle after you go into customize you can see the disciple of the dark ether or just oh no that is of the dark ether this skin looks amazing. It is the Disciple. He's purple, not the normal color that we see him. But the way you can actually purchase this bundle is by pressing square. And then you can see here, the you can see the actual bundle challenges. But furthermore, you can press view bundle. Once again, for me, it's square. And there you go. You can access this bundle itself. And from what we can see here, you get the actual Weaver kind of bundle outfit it is the normal disciple it is amazing i need to cop this it is so much money and so much money has been already spent by me on this game but i just have to and i have to make this video because it is wow it is such a good bundle you also get the 300 card points additional challenges three blueprints for weapons three blueprints with tracers and fire elemental damage which is also very good for forsaken which we will get into in a while but it is an ak-74u it isn't reactive I guess it looks okay-ish, nothing too crazy. You also get an assault rifle, which is the... What is this? Is this the Farah? I think it is the Farah. Okay, this looks better. I bet you this will look amazing in Cold War, but unfortunately, we have to check these bundles out in actual Warzone. And then lastly, the last bundle weapon is the actual... Uh, what is this? RPD, I think it's called. Rip... Uh, also looks pretty cool. Definitely better in Cold War. We will check it out. Uh, you also get a pretty cool charm, which is a jack-o'-lantern. I don't know if we already had like a Modern Warfare jack-o'-lantern charm. Uh, a finisher that we will check out and is probably second best or even top number one for some people in the actual like finishers for zombies a cool disciple emblem and a cool disciple calling card so what i'm gonna do is get some more card points and purchase this bundle and then we're gonna go hop into zombies on forsaken check out some of these weapons not every single one and then we're also gonna go into a private match so i can show you off all of the weapons and the finisher itself see you then now quickly before we hop into the zombie game we need to check out this finisher. It's our boy, Klaus. I don't know why that finisher is so dark, but it's Klaus. And you just get help from Klaus. Literally coming up, picking up the enemy, and you stab the person. And from what it seems like, you, you literally cut them in half nearly. It is absolutely insane. And when you equip it, you literally have Klaus vibing with you in the lobby. <laughs> hey, what did he just do like a little hot? He's flying. Yo, look at him go and then he trots around now You can't really see him very well. You need to wait until the camera kind of zooms out and there he is Look at him. Klaus is vibing with a disciple that is Weaver in a disciple outfit in zombies and multiplayer and he helps you kill people Hmm. <laughs> look at that. That's so cool. So anyway, we decided to spawn in well I decided to spawn in with the Farah and honestly, the only thing that I can see standing out right now are my hands. They are absolutely insane. They're glowing and all. <laughs> that is so cool. But uh, yeah, here is the Farah. And I guess the first thing is to... Ooh, nice tracers. So basically, they're burning tracers. I don't know if I'll be able to get AK-74U and the RPD. We'll check that out in a custom game. Or even a multiplayer game. Because we, I kind of want to unlock the purple style. And we'll look at the challenges for the cut points in a while. But I think the coolest thing about this bundle is not only the Klaus finisher, but also 
the actual skin it is such a good outfit obviously you don't really see your outfit all that much but let's be honest to hop into a game with your friends or even a multiplayer game and to wear this bundle and just kind of show it off it, it feels kind of good you know you're just kind of like yeah i spent money on this game a lot of money but it's for good reasons now, obviously similar to my uh, kind of video that i made on the gallo which a lot of people seem to have disliked the way i phrase it but i said the gallo is pay to win and i say that this is also pay to win on zombies there is one big fat reason this deals fire damage and it's not as good as the gallo because of the brain rot damage because brain rot deals damage to the boss like the boss on this also tempest and lastly mimics which there is a lot of those on this map but unfortunately the only thing that the fire really does more damage to the napalm blast burst whatever you want to call it is i think well obviously the the bosses but also manglers so that's cool but yeah that's actually a pretty cool thing oh my god we have an ak-74 you all buy all right i'll buy that let's let buy the blueprint which one was it again is this a sudden mayhem one? Oh, oh that is it oh that is disappointing <laughs> oh my god i mean obviously the tracers are pretty cool and it is blue rarity but uh like this one actually stands out i guess it's because of my hand yeah i think it's because of my hand the way you hold no way you no what is it no that is... the, the ak-74 u one sucks did i put on the correct blueprint wait let's inspect it let's kill this guy is that the wrong blueprint no that is the one wait yeah, that's a blueprint Ugh. that is that is not a good blueprint, but I guess one thing that we can show off since it's blue rarity is how good fire damage is on the big Chad. Shut up, Peck. Look at that. Extra damage, baby. Woo. Okay, the AK isn't that great, you know, so don't don't judge the damage. Let's check out the Farah. Okay, the Farah isn't great as well. <laughs> I'm out here hyping it up and then like they barely do anything. Bear with me. Bear with me. We'll just buy ammo. And use the fire at green rarity. Come on, fire. Don't disappoint me. Oh! Did we get ahead? We got ahead! Yo, let's switch weapons. Oh! Either shroud. Yo! Yeah, so so basically it just deals extra damage. And it's a variant that you can spawn in with. But again, if I were to be honest, I'd recommend spawning in with that uh, Gallo blueprint than this, uh, if anything. But hey, it comes with a bundle. Why not? You know, why not this one game for this one video? me using it but then again this is for you the viewer the the, the ak-74 u1 is definitely not it not a chief oh, oh my goodness oh my god we have such weird fingers <laughs> but uh, here's the inspect we have the little we have the little the pumpkin thingy and uh, one thing that we can test out as well is to see how a pack a punch camera will look like on it I guess it makes the rags stand out a bit more. The camo on this map in general is very sick, but we have very, very long nails. Weaver, you should probably cut them, man. You know, like, ooh, okay, I know. This camo looks sexy on this weapon. Uh, is there anything that I can... Ooh, this is a great way of actually showing the fingernails. <laughs> We're in bad lighting. Let's get into better lighting. But here's this... Oh, no, wrong inspection. Here's the fingernails. <laughs> Ayo, hey, zombie! But this is definitely one of my favorite like new bundles in the game and it's definitely one of my favorite outfits it's kind of sad that we only got it now i think we should have gotten at least in season five because you know the game's coming to an end but it'll be a nice outfit to always come back and have on my boy weaver which i did purchase the first bundle and let's be honest the second one the one with the dark ether crystals is so much better and this one is even better in my opinion because you're a disciple you know i hate the disciples but man if i can be one i'll take it I'll take it. I guess while we're here and I have enough points, might as well go pack a punch to AK-74U and see how it looks on this poo, -poo ass blueprint. Uh, I mean, it's not the best lighting. I guess... Okay, now it kind of definitely looks better because the actual camo itself is good. And... I don't know. I, I'm not a fan of this blueprint. Oh! <laughs> There's an RPD wall by as well. Oh my god. I'm just here thinking. I was like, oh, imagine if there was like all of the wall buys here for all the weapons. But here's the RPD one. We can also go pack a bunch and look at how it looks. But uh, you know what? I don't like you. I'm sacrificing you. And lastly, here is the RPD blueprint. Ooh. 
Oh, I should have spawned in with this. This looks so much better. Because you can see the glowing parts. And is that actually glowing? That is. See, we can't really see that on here all that well. Because it's at the edge of the weapon. But this is on the actual scope. Which isn't that insane one. But damn, this is a good blooper. And I'm going to collect the points and see how it looks when it's pack a punched. I am excited now. It goes so well with my hands. Sheesh. Ooh. I don't know what it is with the first pack a punch camo, but it's definitely my favorite. Then it goes three and then two. Well, no, then it goes two, then three. Basically, the, no. So number one is the first pack a punch camo. Then my second is the third one. And then the last one is number two. But this looks good. The glowing of the pack a punch camo and then the outline of the edges of the cloth. Whew, the barbed wire. Yeah, this one definitely looks the best out of all the three blueprints. The last one is the AK. Like, if the AK had rags on it and then glowing stuff, maybe, but it just doesn't. It is a poo poo, poo poo, caca, caca, poo poo, poo poo, poo poo, poo poo. So, now the last two things that we're gonna quickly do is number one, I'm gonna go show you the finisher for Klaus, and then we're gonna unlock the purple version of the skin and also quickly showcase it like the hands and stuff and yeah let's let's get into that <laughs> look at the amount of us in this truck yo disciples pull up let's go we about to we about to destroy everyone uh but here we are on forsaken i'm joking we're on the new multiplayer map america and we're gonna quickly go try to finish a bot so we can show off the the cool finisher yo look who it is i don't care Oh, we did it. Oh my god. He picks him up at his ass. He pick he touches his ass But yeah, that's finish. <laughs> that's Klaus your boy Klaus. You thought he was dead. Nah, he's back, baby Klaus has returned. He's definitely one of the cooler ones, but is it better than the zombie one? Mm, I don't know. I don't know, but uh, let's see if we can get it again. Oh, yeah He definitely picks up his booty and then, then we come up and literally slice him from top to bottom, which is kind of dark, kind of, kind of dark. And we're, we must be very heavy, you know, as Weaver and as the Disciple to literally be able to slide down perfectly, because I don't think that's very easy. But as the finisher, I'm going to quickly go unlock the purple version so we can check it out in this video. Okay, and I finally, after not too much of time, unlocked the purple version. What we're gonna do is hop into Mawarder Totem because that is a super dark map. And just in spawn room, I'm gonna show you how the hands glow and everything because that's the best thing I can do. Uh, one thing I'll say, the challenges are actually quite easy. The first one requires you to basically get 50 eliminations or 50 special or elite zombies killed with the selected weapons that are in the bundle. So that's the RPD the AK-74U and the Farah. The second challenge is kind of easy, but also annoying because the zombies version seems to be broken. Basically, you need to get either a bloodbath medal on zombies, which is basically all you have to do is just get like, uh, from what it seems, 20 kills really fast. And I got it, but it bugged out and didn't work. The second one is either on multiplayer, you have to basically get a bloodthirsty, but I'm pretty poo poo caca on multiplayer. So that was more difficult than it should have. And the one to unlock the skin just before the final one is all you have to do is either get 30,000 multiplayer score or 30,000 essence. Essence is probably the easiest. All I did was hop into Forsaken, first room, like round 14, and I had it all because, you know, the spawns are insanely fast in the first room. And then the last one for the actual last cop points, which I haven't finished yet, all you have to do is just basically get either first place in multiplayer, so, you know, like, be top of the leaderboard. You could play, like, one of the special modes or just a normal one and just try to come top leaderboard. You know, be play objective and either on zombies x for five times and that seems kind of annoying so what i have to do let's hop into mower and check out this purple variant all right so here's the skin it definitely looks better than the normal one uh, does it look oh <laughs> actually never oh ho, ho. no turn off that flashlight holy frick this looks insane i'm basically deck ether guys <laughs> The purple version looks definitely way cooler. I haven't tested out the normal one of hour, but like both of them are amazing. So if you're, it's so weird that I'm making a video on a skin and I'm like, look at the hands. Ooh, insane hands. 
But yeah, that's basically it for the for the bundle itself. Probably the coolest thing is the outfit, as I mentioned, and Klaus himself, and the card points. Let's be honest, it's nice to get some card points back. It's not like one of those bundles where you pay like twenty dollars and you get two thousand card points back, which is very unfortunate. But I don't know. It's worth it. You get like three blueprints. This one is definitely the coolest. Like it even glows in this lighting. Oh my god, look at that. It looks insane. And um, what else is there? Oh yeah, the Klaus finisher is pretty funny. Aside from that, nothing else really. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I might be doing a giveaway for this bundle when it comes out. I don't know when it drops. Maybe even when I drop this video will it be out. But if it's not, this is the secret bundle you can unlock in Cold War. Woo! Anyway, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Like the video. 30k here we come before Vanguard. And uh, I'll see you on the next one.